Hello HP Touchpad users, great news! The first Marshmallow builds have arrived for the HP Touchpad. Flintman of the Evervolve team, always evolve, Evervolve, has produced the first early alpha build. Now this might not quite be ready to be your daily driver just yet, but it's incredible to see the latest versions of Android on the HP Touchpad. You gotta come check it out here in his forum thread, look in the video's description. Give him thanks and perhaps a little donation for his hard work. He's been making incredible builds of Android and has really stuck with the HP Touchpad. Here is a list of the things that are not working. This is subject to change. This is just an early alpha build. By the time you watch this, there may be newer builds with more stuff fixed. Currently not working is Bluetooth camera, external SD card mounting, use of the mic can kill the audio, reboot to bring it back, rotation hangs sometimes, and well, other stuff. Let Flintman know in his forum thread here what you find that isn't working, and hopefully we'll get a nice functional build just as soon as possible. So it's just absolutely great to see this. Now let's talk a little bit about installing this build. In order to get these builds installed, you already need to have Android installed on your tablet. Now I'd recommend using JC Stalin's touchpad toolbox and getting something like KitKat installed first, because these builds don't currently support the use of the touchpad toolbox, although that could change in the future. In order to get them installed, you want to flash them through recovery. However, you'll need Flintman's twerp in order to flash the ROM and GFs package through recovery. So start with your regular version of Android installed, then you'll want to flash Flintman's twerp here, reboot the device, and go back into recovery, back into his twerp, and then flash the ROM and then GApps package. That'll be the procedure for getting these builds installed, as long as the touchpad toolbox doesn't support it, which of course may get an update very soon, let's hope. If you don't yet have Android installed on the HP Touchpad, please refer to my super easy way guide, which will take you through the steps necessary to use JC Sullen's Touchpad Toolbox. I got a full thread with all the information, background information, and hell, a lot of Q&A just in case you don't know what the Touchpad Toolbox is or these newer data media builds. Don't worry, all the information is here, you just have to go through it, and of course I've got video guides for that as well. In addition, I also have a how to update and install guide, which will show us the procedures for flashing ROMs, clean installing, and dirty flashing. Now, for this particular ROM, we're going to want to do a clean install with Flintman's twerp, and I've got all these steps and information listed here. Alternately, if we already have Flintman's twerp installed for, say, KitKat, we can simply do a dirty flash with the instructions listed here. Both these guides will be listed in the video's description, please use them for reference. Don't forget to thank Flintman over in his thread here, and perhaps give him even a little donation, because he's been really working hard and a very dedicated developer for the HP Touchpad. Just look for the Donate to the Ever Evolved Team button here in his tagline on any of his posts in the forum. Big thanks to Flintman of the Ever Evolved Team for making these builds happen. Keep up the great work, buddy. We're happy to see it. Please like and subscribe to see the latest updates with the HP Touchpad and Marshmallow. I'll be following along with these builds and letting you know what's new. Currently they're early alpha, but there's lots that can happen, and we may see other ROMs popping up as well. Please subscribe and like the video. Thanks for watching everybody.